I'm Steph. I'm Michael. And today we're going to check out Troy's Dice. Troy's Dice. Ooh. Yeah. I'm excited. I really like Troy. You've been Troy. looking forward to this. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I love rolling rights, you know, <laughs> as I do. As you do. And, uh, you know, I I um, I had a good time. We played it for the first time yesterday, and uh, I'm excited to get it to the stream because everybody can play along with us. Yep. Um, and there are some links in the chat. That have been supplied. Sebastian was worried you wouldn't like it, but you really do like it. So That's I mean, it's, let's put that right up front here. Is that uh, yeah? It's a it's a really fun game. It plays from one to ten people, but really, why can't it be as many people as want to play? Right. 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 So we're gonna play with whoever wants to play in the chat. You can play along. Um, you just gotta find the sheet of paper. Yep. And you'll be good. And I'm pasting it in there again. <laughs> There you go. So, either print that out or use your favorite PDF editing software that you have or take a screenshot of it and use Microsoft Paint or whatever you've got and then you can play along with us. Yes. Right? Absolutely. So, um, oh, I should say by Pearl Games. Um, and it's available now, right? Yes, correct. Yeah. So, uh, they give you a whole bunch of of uh, score pad sheets, mm -hmm. which uh, it's always the same every time. Uh, the only thing that will change on on them each time is the numbers that you will put in here from one to six. What you can do after your first game is you can roll a die and say, I rolled a five here, then this first one will be a five and then everyone agrees Hey, are we going to go five, six, one, two, three, four, or are we going to go five, four, three, two, one, six? You can do either one, but everyone has to do the same thing. So, so make sure you write down one through six. One through six on the top, on each of the red, yellow, and white blocks right there. Yep. Um, everyone is going to start off with three influence and three, uh, what is that, deniers? And three, knowledge. And that's already circled on your sheet. <laughs> so, just like in Troyes, uh, you are going to have the, um, what are those, what are the three colors? Nobility and, where is it at? I had it here a minute ago. I'm not prepared. Oh. Right here. Oh, nobility, the, the civil... Uh, servants and the religious folk. Um, so you are going to build fortresses and great halls and cathedrals and for your prestige buildings. Those will be your top row buildings. And then you will also build work buildings, which would be the Count's Palace, the City Hall, and the Bishopric. And those will be worth certain amounts of points. Uh, so um, for when we play the game, uh, the game is going to last eight days. I'm going to show the board. Sounds good. And I am going to... The town crier is going to roll all four dice. It doesn't matter who the town crier is. But Steph likes it when I do the town crier voices. <laughs> well, of course. <laughs> <coughs> so because uh, the town crier is supposed to call out whenever there's a raid. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> The blue four has been raided, or something like that. Anyway, um, there are three transparent dice and one black die. Black die, bad. That's all you got to know. Um, I'm going to roll four dice, um, and then we are going to arrange them on the morning spaces here. You'll see that there are four morning spaces at a cost of zero denier, one denier, two denier, and this one is one of any resource, either a denier, an influence, or a knowledge. So, I rolled a two, three, four, five, and we will place these like so, going from smallest to largest. The black die is slightly less in value than a transparent die. So, if this were a two, then they would still be placed exactly as they are. Black die uh, will always come before the transparent dice. Um, we are also actually playing with uh, the Banquets and Raids expansion. So those are here, here, and here. I will explain those in just a bit. So everyone is going to get to choose one of these four things in the morning, with the exception of where the black die is, because this little 
uh, market is becoming destroyed. <laughs> Go <Like> on. <laughs> so, um... Step two is resolving the event. At the beginning of each half day, the black die is going to destroy this plaza on which it sits. So you pull it out. It's not going to be available this round. So uh, if you cannot afford to take any of the other actions, which everyone can afford to take the first action, right? We all have three resources of each type. Correct. Um, You can, if you don't have any resources at all and you can't do anything, you take one of each resource, one influence, one influence, one uh, denier, and one knowledge, and your turn is done. You don't get to do anything else. You just get those resources. I had to take it in my you turn. You did it once, I yeah. I had nothing, but actually it really helped getting one of each, so. Yeah. It's better than just getting one coin, so right. <laughs> I get like getting one of everything. So all players are going to simultaneously choose a die. We're not going to draft dice away from people. They're all available to everyone. So you can decide whether you're going to take this red three, this white four, or this yellow five. I think the transparent dice are really cool because it makes it show up literally as a yellow die. But whenever they say yellow die, they mean a transparent die on a yellow disc. Yeah. And that is, it makes it look like it's a yellow die. So that's sort of cool. Yeah. Now, what can you do with uh, these dice? Um, I'll explain that in just a second. But at the end of the half day, I'm going to take this and flip it over. You can always tell what's on the other side by this little arrow here. You can see I flip it over, it's going to be yellow. When I flip this yellow over, it's going to be white. So, that's how that works. That's randomly put out at the beginning of the game, as far as I know. (laughs) Yes, all of these are randomly put out. And when you're using that, uh, the Banquets and Raids expansion, you are going to put this, there are three of them, a white, a yellow, and a red that are the same on both sides. The white's the same on both sides, and the yellow's the same on both sides. Mm-hmm. Those are the ones that these bonuses are going to go on. Yep. And those will be good for you. Yeah. All right. So, or then bad. then we're going to do the afternoon. We're going to roll the dice. We're going to put them out. We're going to um, destroy one of the plazas, whichever one it happens to be. We're going to claim one of these. And then... The day is going to be over. We're going to rotate this one space. And then we're going to lather, rinse, and repeat. On the third day, starting from the third day, this is important before I tell you what all the buildings do. Not only is the black die going to destroy this plaza, it's also going to destroy your buildings that correspond to this number and this color. For example, if this were the third day, and this two were on a white. Everything on that number two, as Steph is showing you there, the number two buildings will be destroyed here and here if you have not already built them. How do you stop them from being destroyed? Ah, we're going to let you know that here in just a second when I tell you the actions in detail. So uh, that is what's going to happen as we go through. I won't let this roll count. Um, I'll turn it back to the day one. On day one and two, that won't happen. Just days three through eight, every time this black die is rolled, you run the risk of something blowing up. I had a, a lot of blown up buildings. You had a lot of... <laughs> and I had no blown up buildings because I built fortresses, right. which is one of the things you can do with your actions. First thing on the list. Actually, let me go ahead and put these back on here just... Because, hey, there's one of each color, there's and one that's, of each really, color. That's, that's really handy. That's handy. So, what you can do with these dice is you can gain resources. So, if you take this and pay, obviously, you're going to have to pay the amount first. You don't get to get the resources yeah, then pay it. No. You can pay it and then take the resources. <laughs> you could take, in this example, three influence or four knowledge or five deniers. Just all you'll do is circle the little... The little uh, cir- the little bubbles. bubbles on there. When you use them, you will cross them off. Hey, look, there's some of them with a uh, little people. little people on it. So yeah. if I were to get five deniers right now, I would go one, two, three, four, five, and I would cross over, uh, pass over this. So hey, I'm gonna get one yellow guy into my citizenry. I'm gonna circle one dude. One dude. Each dude is a victory point at the end of the game. So, Circling you want dudes as many really dudes good. as possible. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, 
The other things you can do, besides gaining resources, is constructing a prestige building. Those are the ones on the top rows. So, with a three red, three red die here, you could build a fortress that is going to protect everything in the three column from being destroyed. That is going to protect the three red and the three yellow and the three white. So, after you built this, this uh, fortress, you will take your pen or pencil and draw around the fortress. And to remind you not to destroy things, build your little parapets up here saying, hey, the three dies protected. That's sort of, that's sort of cool. Um, you also get a person. You will also get a red, yellow, or white person. Now, if you build on both sides of this little diamond, which the rules call a lozenge. <laughs> It's like a you get a Hall's mentholiptus lozenge here. <laughs> wow. <laughs> anyway, if you build on both sides, so let's say I've already built the one in a previous turn, and I build a two, I'm going to get this little red guy and a red guy right here. So I'm going to mark them down here. Ta-da, we did it. Yay. Yay. Um, so that is, I told you about Fortress. The, let me look here. The Great Hall will require yellow dye. The Great Hall is the prestige building for the yellow. And that will allow you to gain three influence per red die available, two guys per red die available, three denier per yellow die available, two yellow citizens per yellow die available, three knowledge per white die available, and two white citizens per white die available. What does white die available actually mean? Well, it's clear that there's one red, one white, and one yellow die available. Black dice, the spots that they are on, are not available. But if for some reason this were here, and these were like swapped around, two white dice would be available. Yeah. So if you were to build the five yellow, and the five yellow, you'll look here, you will get three knowledge per white die available. Mm. How many white dice are currently available? Two. Boom. So you're going to get six knowledge. Nice. If you, at the moment you build that building, not ongoing. Right. At the moment you build that building. Correct. So look at your, what's out there and decide what you want to do. Um, last but not least on the prestige buildings, you'll have the, um, what are the white ones called? Cathedral. Yeah. Those are called cathedrals. Those are going to unlock your in-game scoring bonuses. The first time you do one of these, it's going to give you a one-time bonus, a one-point bonus for every building that matches the cathedral you've built. For example, you see these little guys down here? They will match these little guys on the side. So if you build this one number one cathedral then you are going to get end game bonuses for all of the fortresses you've built. You, so you're going to put a little one there and you're going to get one point for every cathedral you built. The f uh, For every uh, fortress you built, I'm sorry. So if you build all six fortresses, boom, you're going to get six points at the end of the game. Yeah. Um, now that's not going to happen unless you build these cathedrals. The second cathedral you build will also give you a one point bonus for the things that match it. Whether it be fortresses or the red work building, or the great halls, or the yellow work building, or the cathedrals, or the bishoprics, I think is what those are called. <laughs> the white work building. Anyway, the third one you built, you'll notice down here, the third and fourth one that you built of cathedrals, they will give you two points per building that you've built. Now here's here's the dilemma. Do you go at, you have a limited number of things you can do. Right. So do you start putting ones where you have no buildings hoping to put threes in those really good spots later, you might not hit the numbers you need. That's what I did in my first game. And you didn't hit the ones you needed? Is that no, right? I did. Oh, you did? Yeah, I did okay. Well, here's the thing. We did to two totally different strategies. Two points difference in totally score. Totally different. Two point different. <laughs> yeah. I had tons of dudes. She had tons of bonuses. Uh, yes. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Yeah. It was really close, and we did really different things. And you cannot build that building again. That is correct, because you will take your pen or pencil, and you will outline whatever you have built 
So you see how there's little transparent outlines around these. When you when you build a building, it's you built it. It's done. Yeah. Yeah. And you've claimed the thing for it, and that's it. Um. So we've talked about the prestige buildings. Obviously, the other thing you can do is to build a work building. So, um, with a red three, I could build this red three work building. And what is it going to give me? It's going to give me two red dudes. Yay! And the yellow work building gives me two yellow dudes. And the little Bischoff right here is going to give me two white dudes. So, you get more guys... But not as many good bonuses. That's at least two points. But it, hey, that's two points. And also, you'll see that, like, in between some of these things, if you build both of these, you're going to get three knowledge. Yeah. If you build both of these, you're going to get two white guys in addition to the two white dudes you got. Mm -hmm. So, you can start really racking up the, the extra guys. And you got and a lot of bonuses. you're going to get lots of bonuses. So, we have, not only are there the bonuses for going past on certain tracks, they're the column bonuses that are here in the general population. If you can put a red, yellow, and white guy in this column, you are immediately going to get one of each resource. If you can reach this spot here, you are going to get one work building of your choice. Not a prestige building, a work building. That's the lower row thing. Is that correct? Yep. Am I, am I saying it correct? Yes, yep. the work building of your choice. The second row things. If you can get to this column, you'll see where that that's a uh, little... Uh, the end of the work building. The end of the work building thing. You are going to get another work building. Yeah. Um, when you get to this area here, you are going to get a prestige building yeah. of the opposite color. For example, if you have uh, built... If you have gotten to this white guy, you can get a red... Or a yellow. Or a yellow. There's a little slash in between. Sort of hard to see. But a red or a yellow prestige building. Mm. Uh, and then if you can get all the way to the end. You see this little white guy here? You will get a red and a yellow guy. If you can get to the yellow guy, you're going to get a red and a white guy. And you might think, oh, I don't want to get all the way to the end and max it out. It's not bad because the next time you get a yellow guy and it's maxed out, you can put whatever color guy you want. That's really That's good. That's really good. It seems powerful because that every seems, guy is a point. Every guy is a point. So. Yeah. Stray was asking, can you run through an example of the gray die? I think you mean the white die, but. The white, the white die? Yeah. So like if I wanted to build, so on the four, if I wanted to take this four white die, I could either get four knowledge or I could build this four cathedral or I could build this four bishopric. If I build the four cathedrals, hey, this is my first cathedral. I'm going to get one time, a uh, uh, one X, you know, a one point multiplier for that guy. For this type of building. This little guy here is attached to the yellow work buildings. So the prestige. It's basically red prestige, red work, yellow prestige, red, yellow work, white prestige, white work. So Shreya was also, what's the difference between work versus prestige? I think it's just the the first column, and the first row and second row yeah, of each color. Exactly. The first of each is the prestige. The second of each is the work because all the people are at work. Yeah. <laughs> so I thought it when I first saw this game, I was think, thinking, oh, the work buildings, you take your guys and you put them in the buildings. No, it's the no, opposite. You get if them. you have work buildings, you get guys living in your city. Yeah. So, yeah. So the top is prestige, the bottom is work. Yeah. Two dudes. Two dudes. <laughs> so, Looks like but, it's a little blurry there. Man, maybe, maybe not. Maybe a little bit blurry. Yeah. Well, nothing's so, perfect. Nothing's perfect. All right. So, um, now, let's say that these dice are bad and you don't like something about them. Well, hey, you know what you're getting all of these things for? Influence can be used to modify your die roll up or down one for each influence you spend. Hey, that's pretty snazzy. I like that. So if I spend an influence, I can bring, I can take that five up to a six. You cannot raise a die above a six, nope. nor do dice wrap around. You right. cannot change a one into a six, nor a six into a one. But you could spend three prestige to turn a three into a six. You can indeed. Yeah. Or, not that you would ever want to, but you might. You might be missing a one of something, and you might want to tr go make down. something to go that downward. Once. I 
I had to do that one. It happens. Because when that when those buildings are built, they're built. Yeah. So um it's powerful stuff. But, it is powerful stuff. But at stuff. the end of the game, every two that you have left over is every, a point. So. Every two of a matching symbol is a point. So yeah. keep in mind if you're gonna mark off two or three symbols, you wanna make sure that uh that you know you're getting more points than you're losing from scratching out those symbols. Yeah. So what do deniers get you? Deniers basically let you claim the dice. Remember, these are going to cost you money. some amount of money or, for this one, any resource. Yeah, any one of the three. Any one of the three. Finally, what can knowledge get you? You can spend two knowledge to change the color oh, no. of a die. Now, it doesn't change it for everyone, nor does it make another one of those, nor does it make a die turn into a different color die for purposes of the work buildings. The, 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 sorry, the Great Hall prestige, yellow prestige buildings. Right. For example, if I change this uh, to a yellow, four. Yeah, make it a yellow four, there's still only going to be, and I do this here, there's still only going to be one yellow die on there. Even though I change this for me to yellow, it doesn't, it doesn't change it for purposes of that bonus scoring. So only one yellow is going to be available for that bonus. In our game, we had three red dice at the end that last turn. Yeah, it was. <laughs> we like buying, buying. We got like a million. It was like resources. so. Yeah, we had three red <laughs> dice available, and both of us, both Steph and myself, took this. And since three red dice were available, that's nine influence, which is four and a half victory points. Well, I took. That's not I bad. took red people, which got me the bonus of getting another yellow building. Oh, that's building, even And then I got better. that, too. So it was like a super combo. So you me. know how with <laughs> rolling rights, things will chain off of each other? Yeah. So that chained this down here, which chained another building. Yeah, so I got Which double. got whoosh. <laughs> I mean. It was really good. That's what you want to do. And I was thinking initially... This game seems a little simple. When you get into it, you see, wow, there's a lot of good, really chewy decisions here. Yeah. So at the end of the game, you're going to count points, and each of for each of the cathedrals you've drawn, you're going to get that number of bonus points for the building for type. the building types. In Remember, the first two cathedrals, one point per building. The next two cathedrals that you build in that order is going to be two points per. And the last two cathedrals that you build will give you three points for that type of building. Yep. We'll give you examples that as we go through the game and stuff, so you'll know what to do. Um, you'll also score one point for every two, rounded down, obviously, for each of the resource types. Yep. You will also count your guys, and they're grouped in groups of five for you, so you can count... You know, 15, 30, 45 guys. That's what I did. I, yeah, I got you 45 had that. plus. I did not have that. You didn't have that. I had me. like four <laughs> yellow and like seven, like seven <laughs> white. <laughs> and that's going to go there. Bonuses over here. Total points. Ta da. And that would be it. Hey, I think that these guys are intelligent enough to handle the Banquets and Raids expansion. I think so. So. We are. We have taken three random tiles. There are actually, what, 12 of these tiles? Man, 15 maybe nine. tiles? There's quite a few tiles. There's a bunch. It's pretty good. Um, they are going to add positive effects, which are banquets, and negative effects, which are raids. So, um, whenever the black die destroys the plaza on which a banquet sits, it's going to flip over to the raid side. Remember, these... These plazas here that the banquets and raids sit on, they're the same on both sides, so you don't have to flip those. But this banquet will permanently switch over to the raid side, and it will have a negative effect for this die for the rest of the game. No. Yes, that's what happens. <laughs> so, what, uh, and that's whenever the black die hits that tile space, that plaza. Maybe it will never hit. And in our game, one did not, one missed for the entire game. Yeah. The other two got turned into raids. Yeah. But, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, what are these? Let's talk about them. This one here. This one is attached to... Uh, the white. The white one here. You Let could me, probably kind of put them right there. Put it right there. There you go. Sort of hard to do it. <laughs> this one here. If it's on the banquet side, if you use this die to construct a cathedral, wow. you will gain one of each resource. 
Fortunately, it's, it's on, on the on white. The white. <laughs> That's well. Steph said, "Well, what if that were? What if it was on a red one? What if it's on one of the red plazas?" I was like, "That's where you spend your knowledge, knowledge. to change the color yeah. to actually do the cathedral." Yeah, I didn't even realize that. That was that was good planning on my part, even though I didn't plan. <laughs> <laughs> so it was just accidental that got put there. Yeah. Uh, if it gets turned over to the raid side, ooh. That's ugly. Um, this die costs you a knowledge in addition to the cost on the wheel. Ouch. Ow. Wow. That's really bad. Actually, it's it's. I'm actually on the wrong one. Oh, yeah. I need to be like over here. There you go. Do we want to put it on there? Do we want yeah, to put it? Yeah, I think we should put them on there. If you're, I can do that. Yeah, then we know it's. Then people can see it up close. Yeah, but we can't see. <laughs> oh. Well, it's up to you. It's fine. It'll be fine. All right, this one here. Oh look, it's a you. You match these up. It's good. I didn't mean to. You didn't mean to. So let me put this on the where it belongs here. When it's on its banquet side, if. Do, 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 do. If you use this die to construct a great hall, wow. calculate your gain as if there were an additional die of the required color oh, available. That's so good. Calculate your gain as if there were additional die of the required color. So, meaning, if I use this as a five and there is one white die, count it as two white dice. So you would get. Six knowledge. That's good. That's really good. I'm going to pay two bucks for that. <coughs> yeah, that's really good. When it is on its raid side. Bloop. Ooh, that's bad. Um, I'm trying to find out where it is. You cannot use this die to construct a prestige building. Okay. You see it's got the three prestige buildings on there? Yeah. And a big red X. You cannot build You that. cannot build a that top level thing. All right. But Bad. it's still on its banquet side. Do not put the black die there first. That would be, <laughs> That'd be really rude. Rude. Roll the black die in low. All right. So this one goes down here on this red one. Yep. This one doesn't necessarily match. Nope. Um, that is the one with the knowledge Looks on like it. Looks like you can spend one knowledge to you may, it to any color. Yeah. You may modify the, the color of this die by spending one knowledge instead of two. With the raid side, you can't use knowledge to change the color of that die. All right. That's so fine. it's it's going to be stuck red <laughs> no matter what. Yeah. Or, and and yeah, that's yeah, after red. the black die hits that spot. Yeah. And remember, we're not actually going to start crossing off buildings until we reach day three. And day, you know, my but glory, my we could still <laughs> We could still lose those plazas. I know. Um, with, we could lose the banquets. So that's... Hmm. All right. Is everybody ready? I think we're good. Good-ish. Good-ish. Now I'm going to use... I don't have the box top available. Here. I gave you a... Oh, yeah. You did give me that. Look at that. See? You're so I'm nice. Prepared. Oh. No. One. Oh, two, Michael. Killing us six, six. already. Six. Oh, look at that. Okay. This one... Flipping right over. Dang. All right, so going forward, we'll have to spend extra... Extra knowledge to right. change the color. Is that what that is? All right. It is an extra coin to use that tile. It's oh, it's a... Yeah, it's, an, it's a knowledge in addition to the cost of the tile. Yeah. Yes. And so it would cost you... To use this six, it would cost you two deniers plus a knowledge for this little... Uh, token right here that's bad and this you're not using this you're not using at all oh it's the, oh no it's not this one it's this one. see that's the thing i don't have the if i don't have the tiles here it's hard for me to it's hard for me to see okay then put them there yeah sorry i'm i'm pointing to the wrong i'm pointing to the wrong wheel unfortunately yeah so when using this die it would cost you an additional knowledge but you can't do it right now anyway because it's being rated the the first one shrey is always zero the second one is any one resource either one dollar one influence or one knowledge the third space is one dollar 
And the fourth space is two dollars. They're really deniers. Deniers. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Zero, one of anything, specifically one denier, two denier. Man. Man. I don't know. I feel like I should just build fortresses. Right now, we're not getting anything blown up, but last time I had tons of things blown up in my face. Well, that's possible. So I have to spend either a dollar, a knowledge, or an influence. I'm going to build a fortress. Yay, so happy. Alright. Alright, so that's the Nollers. <laughs> the Nollers. <laughs> I'm not going to spend all the time tracing everything. <laughs> so, as you see, I have... Oh, you did the same I've thing I I've done the same thing. Well, it was a pretty good strategy for me to not get all my stuff blown up. Yeah. Having some things blown up isn't so bad. It's not so bad. The Nollers. But... but because we have a red die right now, might as well keep it that way. So that cost me one of something. I used Though one. I probably should have taken that. But if the, if if I would have taken this, if that die was here, then we would have. I would have had three bonuses on that white. Three bonuses. So that's yeah. two bonuses. Right. Yeah, because if this were here, that'd be one, two, three. I didn't yeah. get my red dude. All right. Yeah, you sure gotta to, get your make red. Make sure to collect your people. Yeah. If there's something in the building that you circle. Then you're gonna get you're gonna get the uh, guys for it. Yeah, I got that dude. Yeah, the Nolliers. I think we're good. I think and we're good. We would normally flip over where the black die is, but it's a white. On it's a side. yeah. Now that, we're gonna do the that afternoon. Was, that was morning. Prices Day are the one. same. Price. Prices are the same, but where I put uh, these dice okay. is different. We're not losing because we're going points. around. You missed. Okay, yeah. I missed it on purpose. Gotcha. So. This one costs you only one knowledge to change the color of this die if you don't want red two. I just did a red two. Three yellow. So you can build a building or you can take the resources. Seems ridiculous to spend two money. This for is red. not available, by the way. Yep, you can't do that. It's going to be blown up. I don't know what to do. So nothing, I just took nothing for two. free. I know, me too. It's That's very, what I was just it's saying. It's really annoying. It's really bad. And I don't necessarily want this. Because there's only. I yeah. could. That's not uh, great. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> Are you not? I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. Burp. You're gonna murp? <laughs> I've never done an urp before. I'm gonna build this little workstation right there. Uh, Even though it's protected, it's probably a mistake. Mistakes were made. I made them. You you made you made them. Yeah, I made the mistakes. Maybe I should get a, like a a marker. I'm gonna do something rather interesting. I am going to spend. I'm gonna spend um, one knowledge to change this to a yellow. And I'm going to pay for it with influence. So, that gives me this here. Oh no, I wanted I wanted it to be a one. Oh, I'm going to put I'm going to, I'm going to pay one to to change it to a one. That's what I want to do. I've got two red dice available, so I'm going to get six influence. Must be nice. Uh... It is nice because that gives me an extra red dude. Okay. So yeah, I did this work, this great haul right here. Mm. All right, this flips over. It's going to be a red from, well, for the moment anyway. So how did you get it down to a one? I spent an influence. Oh, you did this one. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I could have probably done this one. I got I you. did this and I bought it and I, I changed the color mm. for one knowledge and I changed the number by one. Making it a yellow one. Okay. With two red dice available. Gotcha. Gives me six influence. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now I've got lots of influence I can spend. Yeah, that must be nice. It is nice. I like it. So, these come up. It is now day two. We rotate. It is really crunchy. It's really fun. Yeah, I like it. I 
Oh, uh, looks like we've got a two, a three, a okay, three, and a six. Fortunately, we don't get this I one can't destroyed. Believe we have two red. Are you kidding me right now? Yeah, uh, yet another. If you have not done it, you're too red by now. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I'm so mad. Uh, um, could just do that, man. I I'm gonna build this. Yeah, it's probably the better option. Because that you treat it as if there were two yellow dice available. Uh, yeah. Because of the banquet. No, here. I know. I mean, it's really good. I just wish I thought about it. <laughs> Before you did your thing? No, but I need to protect my city. <laughs> it's got big problems. <laughs> got big problems. Harder to try. All right. I'm sure. Hoping everyone has uh, made your decisions. Uh, this one, fortunately, is already blown up, so it's Doesn't good. Doesn't blow up again. Doesn't blow up again. Now, no buildings are being destroyed at this point because we're only in day two. Yeah, day two. Well, afternoon two now. How can Steph be mad at Red? That's true. Blasphemy. Come on. How about a one and a five? And a five. Wow. And a six. I should take a five while I can. It's only a dollar. It's a dollar. It's my last dollar. It's your, it's your last dollar? Yeah. This is what happened last time. Safe. That does. Oh, I that got is? a bonus. I should make sure to get my people. This one is not. not no. Obviously, the black die one is not available. Yeah, it's going to be. Flipped in a second. God, what do I do with this crap? What does the tile on the yellow do? This says what tile? Um, yellow? this there's a the tile this tile on the yellow. Oh, okay. So that one. Stray this tile on the yellow. If you use it to build a great hall, then the bonus is going to be one additional die of the type you need. Yeah. Which is what I did. I. I did this one, and at the time there was only one yellow die, but I treat it as if there were two yellow dice there. So it gives me six coins instead of three. Oh, that's really good. So, yeah, I'm still deciding what I want to do for this mess. Mm -hmm. So basically for one resource, I can like get a whole bunch of coins. I'm guessing once the coins are maxed out, they are maxed out. I'm pretty sure. Uh, so I'm not sure I want to like max any of those out any farther but i mean this being for free mm -hmm. it it does not suck but uh you also have a good point to protect the fives which i have not done yet yeah and for one gold yeah it seems like that might be the good plan and it does give me a white dude it's my first white one. Yeah. All right. Picking them up. Flip. Dick, dick, dick. Yeah. Day three. Uh, oh, hey, look. The middle of the wheel will tell you that a raid is coming. That means wherever the black die falls, then that's what's going to get destroyed. All the buildings will get destroyed in that area. Mm-hmm. If you have not already created them. Right. All right. We've got a two, two, four, six, two, All right. two, four, six. Saved. Red fours wow. are destroyed. Oh. Red I four didn't get that standing far. by. Ooh. So if you have not built your red fours, they are both gone and unavailable. The raiders have come in and destroyed them. No. Now remember, this one, if you take it, it costs you zero plus a knowledge. Yeah. So just know that. Wow. Two. Man, everything is just terrible. <laughs> just 
It's all terrible. Everything is terrible. Ugh. All right, so I'm going to kill this. Wow, there's only one of each color available. Unless you take this and take the with and get the bonus with it. Yeah, I'm debating that. I am also debating it. But I don't think, well, oh, there's still only one of each color, which is like. Well, like I said, sad. it becomes two of each color if you do this. So I'm changing it. I'm I'm using influence to make it a three. Hmm. Then you will get six dollars. The the dollars. The dollars. <laughs> <laughs> classic. A classic. <laughs> Derek said, "Raid, raid, raid." <laughs> oh, man. It's a, you can put the little raid icons up there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that's three morning. Flip. Oh, it's yellow now. Okay. Free afternoon time. Uh oh. Yellow six is uh, white six is gonna be the problem. I have it protected. I do not. White six gets destroyed. Oh, you're playing like me last game. Yes, I am. <laughs> Why? Yes, I am. All right. No. <laughs> no. No. Yeah. Yeah? It's free, though. What? I could, free? Ta I could take you a could two take yellow. It. You it's can. free, and I do need free. A four. Well, the four red already got blown up, so I could protect. No, it's all you blown up. You still protect. I, I can't. Right? Oh, you can't. That's it's right. It's gone. I, I, I've lost you my can't chance do it. <laughs> to, to do a barracks. <laughs> all right, you so lost that, your chance. that makes my choices easier. All right. I got some. Gives me one of everything. I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you everything. So I'm gonna do the five. Have fun storming the castle. Thank you, Splitty. Thanks for stopping by. Have Appreciate fun storming you. the castle. I gotta write my name on it. Otherwise, it's not mine. Oh yeah, there's a spot for your name. One, two, three, four, dudes. Seventeen people out there. Hopefully they're playing it with us. I hope so. See, I think Streamlabs has a like a much longer delay, so I have to figure out if I can make that delay I doubt faster. It. I doubt it though. I doubt it has. No, I doubt it del gives del more delay. Mine is really delayed. I keep updating it. You know, you know why you experienced uh, um, issues earlier? I think Twitch is just overloaded. Mm, it could be. Yeah, fairly sure that's what it is. Flip. The whites are becoming hard to come by, guys. Day four. Four. Day four. Oh, looks like. No! Boom. Oh, it's so sad. Five. Oh. Six. This is no longer. And I don't even have protection for the one yellow. I'm glad, I'm glad I built those yellows already. So, I also do not have protection, but I've already uh, built one. Man, that's so bad for so, me. So, yeah, I've already got one of them built, so it's safe. This is now unavailable to me, though. I was going to... Uh, I was going to... And the lozenge is unavailable to Steph. Look, she was about to do it. I was going to do it. And it's... the lozenge, the lozenge can never be done. <laughs> what, a, what a word. <laughs> what a word. What a word. It's a five red. That's a five red. Well, and it only costs one knowledge to change the color. No, it's not that bad. That's pretty good. But we don't have any white dice. No, I see yellow sucks. forever. It really. I could like spend, you know, I could spend that to change it to a yellow, and then change it, influence it by one. So I could spend one of everything to make this a four yellow. Yeah, look, see, with this being white and it on the four. There's no white this entire day. So sad. We haven't it's seen like so any, sad. any white. There's no and, white out here. And I'm down to one. Oh, you know what I could do? Oh, this is perfect. I need to do this. For one, one knowledge yeah. and one dollar, because that's what it costs, I'm going to change this to a five white and get five knowledge. Because I think I need that. 
I think I need it too. One, yeah, two, you could take three, resources. four, five. I'm taking resources this time. Michael, you should always carry for protection. Video stats say 1.76 second delay. Oh, that's really not bad. So that's not bad. Maybe it's just my phone. All right, so I changed the color. It's a five. I could take, I could copy you, but I don't want to copy you. But it's not a bad idea. <laughs> but your plan has merit. But your plan has merit. <laughs> uh, Do it. I don't want to, but I will. One, two, three, <laughs> two, three four. four. That's going to cost... Got, wait, wait. Did I, you change the color? I already did. I had already paid for it and, you and paid changed for it the and color. And changed the color. I was debating if I wanted to spend influence to change uh, the number gotcha. or not. But... Think, 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 think. Afternoon. Oh, check, check the, the floor, floor for, for pieces. pieces. <laughs> it's under your foot. Excuse me. I'm going all the way <laughs> under the table. Always have a long delay on the phone app. Agreed, I, I do too. Oh, what's going to happen here? Two. Crumble four. No. Yeah. Oh my God, I just keep losing everything. I am also losing oh. it. So four yellow, destroyed. I keep, the town is like going to pieces. Four yellow, destroyed. How does one get money in this game? Um, um you could right now spend one denier to take four denier. Correct. That's how you get money. You can always spend the color die to get the resource associated with it. You'll Correct. see it in the bottom of each of the boxes right here. That's how you get that's how you get uh, influence and knowledge as well. But instead of building a building, you are taking resources. So two. Come on. Maybe I already I have that protected. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna spend. Too red. An, I'm gonna spend an influence <coughs> to get a three. So I can oh yeah, the, you're gonna protect the threes. Well, yeah, because I know that as soon as I don't do it, it's gonna you're rolling threes, and I'm gonna lose all my threes. You know, I think I may start angling for the bonuses at the uh, at, at this moment. I'm just trying to stay alive. All I see are X's on my board, <laughs> <laughs> and I keep losing opportunities to gain. What do you call it? lozengers? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> lozengers. I don't know what, what it is. It's a word I don't know. Lozenge. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Yellow four has been destroyed. <laughs> All right. So because I took cathedral number two, I'm going to get one point. For every one of these red work buildings. Currently, I have none. But I'm hoping to get other bonuses to make my good ones worth three. Well, that's what I did the first time. That's game. what you did, I'm yeah. like, I'm putting my ones on the yellows. I'm not going to build any yellows. I'm taking a, <laughs> I'm taking a huge risk here. Because I knew I was going to build all the whites and all the reds as best I could. So Derek, I wanted them to be higher in value. Derek made a white one. Well, they... He probably adjusted and influenced. Wow. Day number five. We are halfway through this game. Whatever you planned on doing, everything falls apart now. <laughs> yeah, it's already fallen. Uh, looks like we have a one. Oh, no. Oh, come on. <sighs> Dang it. So you cannot influence you, this spot You cannot anymore. influence. You cannot use knowledge on that, that anymore. That was Michael, you suck. It's not me. It's, it's you. The... You're rolling them dice. No. Oh, four yellow I can't use. Great. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Could use it. There are things you can do. Two dollars. I'm not saying they're good things to do. I just said there are things you can do. There's little I can do. <laughs> I'm going to have to change this to like a one red. Change, maybe protect, change it, that. protect that while I still can. Uh, it's all bad. Oh. What did you do? I didn't draw this the square. I circled it. Sir, circle me. It's a square. 
That's okay. I need one. I think I need, I need, if I get one more white guy, then I can I can get one of each resource. I built all the fortresses that I could. <laughs> <laughs> and the plague strikes. That's right. That's awful. Bring out your dead. We need it to turn over to be white. We need white available to us. I am going to... Well, white's about to be available to He's like, I really need some white dice. That's, what, that's basically what I just said. White is about to be available to us. Maybe. One, <laughs> if, two, if you put the three, black die here. Four. One guy gives me one of each resource. All right. Wow. I, had to, uh, I had to change this to white to make myself some, some knowledge because our whites... Are not easy to get. Yeah. So I'm hoping. That's probably the better play. Everybody's smarter than me. Five afternoon coming up. I'm not dead. I'm, I feel I'm not dead yet. Okay. Three. I like this. Yellow four is already dead. Five. Six. And if you want to take this, not only is it two denier, it's also one, one knowledge. knowledge. It's not great, but you might have to do it. <sighs> Cathedral time, I guess. Cathedral time. Seems so pitiful. But I'm going to do it anyway. All right. I am building this cathedral with one influence. <laughs> It reminds me of the very ancient Monty Python game where you played Tetris with the yelling bodies. <laughs> Filling ridiculous. in the plague pit. All right. All right, you're flipping it over to white, so that means we'll get... Well, some. now we're starting to get some white opened up. Day number six. Looks like we have a two, a three, a five, a six. No! 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 And you cannot change the color of this. Oh, I didn't actually have to cross that out because I have it protected. <laughs> I forgot. All right, so it's still technically available. <laughs> <laughs> that one. Is Your sheet is a wreck. Thanks. Um, Thank so you. So yeah, yellow three. If it's not protected, yellow three is destroyed. Two dollars. Uh, yeah, that is two dollars. You're correct. Or I could change the color of that and pay a dollar to get that, which would be worth two. It's not bad. Yeah, remember, you can't change that color. No, you cannot. I'm talking about this. Yeah. You're not the boss of me. What are you doing? Changing my X's. Shut it. I got time. <laughs> this is still okay. This is this is not okay. It's still okay. <laughs> Changing the color, paying a dollar. Taking the cathedral. Cathedrals are worth two for me now. Ooh. 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 Yeah, fancy Ooh. pants. Fancy pants. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, cost me two dollars. Yeah, I gotta get like way down there. I'm not gonna get way down there. That's ridiculous. All right, afternoon the sixth. It's like, how did you get all these people last time? Like, I don't even know. Work buildings. Yeah, I, I was like, I'm gonna get all the work buildings this game. No, everything no. blows up. Everything has been terrible for me this time. Two, three, four, which cost an extra knowledge, and six, which could not have been used to do prestige buildings anyway. Oh. Did I flip? Did I flip whatever it was that it was, it was on? It was on to this be one. Yellow, yeah, that was the one. Flip it. Flip it to red. Cause yeah, cause it killed yellow three. Yep. I failed I to do so. Mistakenly. Yeah, that's the one you mistakenly did. Yeah. All right, so two white, three red, four white with an extra. Knowledge with an extra you knowledge, you got to pay, and then this is this two is the black is unavailable. As it is. What's this guy? Eh. Yeah. Alright, two. Oh, 
sure. Man. I mean, we got like, what? Four turns left? <laughs> Ouch. Uh, we have four more actions left, yes. It's really bad. Yeah, I'm not chaining anything this game as much as I did last game. Yeah. I keep screwing things up. So, here we go. <laughs> this is your life. All right. I should use my influence. I'm Morning like, why don't I use my influence? I'm using it all the time. Wow. Now that I'm seeing how this works, I'll need to play it again. My printer's terrible, though. <laughs> yeah. It, that's the way That's the way it is, Trey. One and one red is now destroyed. I got a, I got a barracks. That's good for you. It is not for me because it is destroyed. One, three, five, six. Oh no, you're in, you're in the. Oh, I'm in the wrong one. Still, red one is destroyed. Sorry, that was wrong. Three. Don't take anything. One, three, five, six. Yeah, so it's really here. I put them in the wrong spots. It is still red one that is destroyed though. Yeah. That did not. Five. Sadly, that did not change. There is a chance that my last cathedral can blow up, so I am going to fix that situation right now by changing the color of that red to a white and claiming my last one. Um, and I need to pay one resource for it. Man, I'm going to get work buildings. No. No, I'm really bad at getting work buildings. Yeah, me too. Well, it's because you want barracks, but you don't. But you do. Uh, but you don't. But you do. You really do. Seven afternoon. Well, see, I did all barracks last time, and I thought, oh, this time I'm going to do something different. And yeah, it totally screwed me up. One. One, one. One. Two. Four. Two yellow. Crumble. Two yellow is gone. If Oh, wait. I'm protected there. Exactly. You're like me now. I'm like you now. <laughs> All right. So remember, if you take this one white, you're going to have to pay the extra knowledge. That's right. That's right. That's right. So it'll be a knowledge and a something. Man, only two dice left? This is awful. And look, we've got no banquet spaces left. I mean, they're that's all poor. The banquet spaces are poor now. I mean, it's so horrible. Why did I do this? You regretting your life choices? Um, yes. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh... <laughs> Wow, these are just... I am so going to lose this. And Shrey, even though you have a really ugly board, you're still going to win. For two coins, I'm going to take this four. I'm going to boost it to a five. I did so much better the other game. Yeah. Me too. Could boost it to a six. No, I'm going to be safe and just do a five. One, two, three. All right, so that's not going to flip because it doesn't flip. Hey, morning the 8th. Two more rolls left. Oh, my God. Two. Three white destroyed. Oh, I called it. I was, I was one turn early, but I, I, I knew it was going to be destroyed. Three white is destroyed. We got one white. Two red dice. Two red dice. Alright, so if I change that color. Mm. I 
I'll get four red dudes if I do that. And then I can build any. Wow. You just got a bunch of dudes. Yeah. That was the plan. Well, good. Well, yeah. For one and one boost. Oh, but I've only got one white available. Cool. And I'm about to lose a white spot. I'm never going to have whites available. That's the bad part. I get a free prestige building. But which one do I want? It's so hard to decide. Getting two white workers would be good. That's what I'm doing, two white workers. But I really need to score buildings, so... I... Unfortunately, I'm... I've... I've shut myself out of what I wanted to do. Wow. I'm not going to be able to combo anything else, sadly. That's just the way it is. The explosions are just too much. They killed us, didn't they? All right, this flips. Well, it won't matter because we're not coming back to that hey, side. Hey, we, we got raiders. Hey, Panic Games. Thank you for the raid, guys. We're finishing up a game of Troy's Dice. Yeah. pa -pow. Oh, two, uh, three, ugly six, six. If you have anything on yellow six, it's gone now. I got if a, you hadn't built it. I got a fortress. Seems good. Oh, this man. cannot be used to build prestige buildings. This cannot be, uh, this will cost you an extra, mm -hmm. um, oh, an yeah. extra no. knowledge to you to I purchase. dislike that. Dislike. <clears throat> Man, three. Oh, you can't use. You can't build prestige. That's buildings. what I said. Uh, you cannot build prestige buildings. No. You can build work buildings with this. You cannot build prestige buildings with this. No, Michael. That's not me. It sounds like it's you. It's not me. You can't blame me Look for at this. All those emotes. I love it. The explosion of emotes <laughs> everywhere. Man. Well, I can't afford this because I don't have two denier. Well, that's a problem. No, I'll just have to do something else. Let's go do something else. Not Mark really, man. not really a major problem, but it's not what I wanted. This is totally not what I wanted. <laughs> All right. Well, I don't really have a choice, so I could drop the three to a two. Dropping the three to this a. Is Making it a yellow two work building. I'll be surprised if I uh, do. If I do well at all. Because I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think I did very well. I'm going to get like half of the score I got the other day. Actually, don't. I should not use this and make it just a red three. Because I get more points for the cathedrals. In oh, I can't use prestige buildings. <laughs> more important, Michael. Hello, Laura's here. Hello, Laura. Change the color of this, raise it by one. Mm, I don't think it's going to matter. It is not going to matter. I'll do what I've already done here. Well, I didn't do that much worse than the other day, but I still did worse. Wow. That was horrible. Walk through scoring, please. Yes, absolutely. Yes. All right, so... I have built all of my cathedrals except this last one, right? So, in the order that I built them, I have put ones, twos, and threes over here on the side. In the order that I built, as I built them, like when I built this, these two, I put ones in each of them. Yeah. Then I built these two, so I put twos in them. Then lastly, I built this one. Sadly, this one down here got destroyed, but fortunately... 
I didn't put any, I, I didn't build those buildings, so it's not a huge loss. So, how scoring works is I have got two barracks times two is going to be worth four points for me. I've got one times no buildings <laughs> is a big goose egg. <laughs> I've got no extra influence, so that's worth two for two influence for every victory point. Zero divided by two is zero. All right, this is my good one here. Three times six buildings is 18 whopping points. Oh, that's good. And that's the majority of my points. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, me too. <laughs> one times this one building here that I sort of messed up, it's not dead. I get one point. And then I've got no dollars left over. So again, a big nothing right there too. Two times each cathedral, that's 10 points. And then nothing there, so... And I've actually got one, two, three, four, five of these knowledge available. Oh, so that's going to be worth two points. All right, then count my guys up. That's five, 10, 15, 18 whopping dudes. That's nothing. That's a third of my population last game. <laughs> I know, you had them all. I had, I had things over here. Yeah. So total for me, 18, 19, 29, 31, 35. In bonuses? Yep. 35, that's 53 total. If I've, if I've math correctly, 4, 12, 4, 22, 23, 33, 35, yep. That is the walkthrough for scoring. Your bonuses, add your people, half yeah. for each resource, that's it. Steph is going to do hers, or has done hers. Yeah. She's got three times her five. Uh, five. Uh, fortresses, which is 15 points. She has three of these red work buildings times two each is six. She has two of these great halls times one is two. Nothing for here for the cathedral. She doesn't have, she has one influence for no points. She has three deer for one point. Five times two is 10. Nothing here. No extra for here. And your guys, five, 10, 15, 19, 23. So 23 and 34 in bonuses is? 57. 57? Wow. It's a lit. So yeah, I remember yesterday I had... I got 53. She got 57. What'd you guys get? Shrey got 45. Shrey didn't realize that he had to do these in, or yeah, in that, order. Yeah, that's, that's the risk. That's the risk that you take. The first cathedral that you built gives you a 1x multiplier where one. you build it. Yeah, that's what this little iconography that's over... Down here in the, the bottom. Corner means... It's, it's kind of hard to, to the explain. The first two cathedrals. Now, now, now you know that. Oh, yeah, The yeah, first yeah. two cathedrals you built gives you a 1x multiplier specifically on those cathedrals you built. In other words, you put you put down, like if he's your first one that you built, then you look where that little guy's picture is. I, literally, they're in, they're in order right here from the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 cathedral. Right. 89, Derek owned us. <laughs> wow. Wow, Derek. What was your strategy? Whatever, it was, Derek. It was, <laughs> that wasn't what we did. We decided, we took the lose strategy. I lose at all cost the strategy. Lose strategy. Derek is bragging rights for sure. <laughs> bragging rights it, Derek. That's all yours. Um. So, yeah. Well, the first game I, I got like 30 people and 31 uh points over here so that mine was heavily lopsided was people over bonuses knowing is half the battle gi joe um yeah so t-r-o-y-e-s troyes dice last <laughs> played yesterday yes yes we did i got 57 i got 53 sure and again got. Again, I, I think our strategies were more similar this time, but again, we're four points different. Well, it was hard because I wanted to do, um, where is it? Okay, there we go. I wanted to do barracks, but we weren't really rolling red dice, and then I'm like, things were blowing up because I didn't have the barracks, and then I was like, ah. And see, it's there's infinite replayability because of, hey, where do these pop up? Right. 
How do they come out? Right. Do you use the banquets and raids? I like it. I like using the banquets and raids expansion. Oh yeah, it why adds not? more I mean, to it. There are eight it's, tiles that you can mix. Yes, and match it's there. included in the box, so it's not like something you have to get in a promo. Yeah, it actually is in the box. Yeah, um, and it doesn't add a whole ton of complexity. Right. But it it makes those plazas so that they're not just double sided of the same thing. Something bad will happen when they get hit. It's yeah. not just that nothing happens. Be, it's just unavailable. Hurt. It will be hurt. Right. So you don't want to see them get blown up. Wow. Derek had 45, 45 in dudes, dudes and 44 in points. Wow. Seems really good. Yeah. Cathedral Multiplier is not done at the end of the game. It's done at the moment you build it. And that's the risk. Do you put ones where you think you're not going to have buildings? And then, well, by the end of the game, well, can you I, actually put those in the right cathedrals to make those times three? Right. And that's what I tried my first game. Like, I know I don't want to go for yellow. So if I go strictly for white and red buildings, I'm going to put the ones in the yellows. And that actually worked for me fairly well because I got a bunch of higher points for the things I knew I was going to focus on. Um, but, yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. I like it. I think it's pretty good. Yeah. Um, I actually think there's a lot of similarities between Troy's and, and this, even though it's very different. Obviously, it's very, very different. I don't see it because there's no stealing of dice. No, but you're changing your dice for, for things. With influence. And, and, and the, yeah. I mean, I can see the resemblance. So, I know you can or whatever. I mean, but I, I, there are it's, three it's different colors there. of... Yeah, there's there's factions. The three different factions, yeah. And, like, and then the black dye nobody likes. Yeah, yeah. the black dye nobody likes, so... I, I think it, it's pretty good. And by nobody likes, I don't mean that we hate the mechanic. I mean, you just hate to see the black die hit right. what you want. Exactly, so, yeah. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Derek got his bragging rights. Very nice. <laughs> well deserved. This is your 10th play of it. Wow. You've played this a bunch. Wow. So that's that's why that's why He's he killed us. He's got skills. That's why he mad skills. <laughs> He's got mad skills. <laughs> that's why he killed us. That's why he killed us. And that so, yeah. Troy has dice nice. from Pearl Games. Um, check it out. It's worth it. Worth picking up. Yeah, I like it a lot. I mean, a small footprint too. I mean, you guys saw me on the on the. Those of you who follow Steph on Facebook saw. You know, I'm holding this up. You know, it's really small. Yeah. So, small enough anyway. Oh, all right. We'll be right back. See you in a minute.